Welcome, let us work out this question on logarithms. So given that logarithm of 4 is equals to 0 0.6021 and logarithm of 6 is equals to 0 0.7782, without using mathematical tables or calculator, evaluate logarithm of 0 0.096. So let's go to the solution. So we have logarithm of 0 0.096. So we can write this one uh, in terms of its fraction. B96, logarithm of 96 divided by 1000. The second step, we're going to split 96 in terms of its factors. And the factors you're going to use uh, should include 6 and 4. So 96 splitted will be 4 squared times 6 then we divide by 1000 then from this stage this one recall some basic laws of logarithm the first one log a times b is given by log a plus log b then the second one you're going to use these are some of the basic laws of logarithm this one should give logarithm of a minus logarithm of b so we can proceed from there to knowing these basic laws so when you split this one using these uh, basic laws we shall have logarithm of 4 squared plus logarithm of 6 minus logarithm we can write our thousand as 10 cubed this one further log 4 squared minus 2 log 4 then this one is log 6 this will be log 10 raised to power 3 can be written as 3 log 10 so from here we can now substitute the values the values this is a 2 we are given log 4 as 0 0.60 plus log 6 we are given as uh, 0 0.7782 then minus 3 this will be 3 since logarithm of 10 to the base of 10 all these logarithms are given to the base of 10 so log logarithm of 10 to the base of 10 is 1 so this will be 3 times 1 which is 3 now we are not supposed to use any calculator so we're going to multiply manually so we have 0 0.601 is 6 then multiply by 2 this will be given by 2 4 0 12 1 then we add 0. 77h2 when we add these we get 4 this is 12 this is 8 this is a 4 this is 12 this is 8 this is 9 sorry then this one is 1 so we have 1.9h24 minus minus 3 so this one we can we can subtract this one so you can this one you can write it as 3.000 so we have 3.000 minus remember the answer you're going to get here is negative so 1.9824 so this would be 6 this will be 7 this will be 1 this will be 0 and remember the 2 will be 1 but remember since we are subtracting a bigger number from a smaller number therefore the answer will be we are going to retain that negative so the first solution is negative 1.0176 so that is uh, one solution that is possible uh, in this question. Now there's still another um, 
another solution that you can get, you can obtain from the same. Um, and this is how we get it. So from here, uh, from this point, we can write this one as uh, logarithm of 4 squared uh, plus logarithm of 6 plus this will be logarithm of this is uh, when you write this one and is in the denominator this one can be written as 10 raised to power negative 3 so this is another way you can do it alternative way so this gives write this we can remember this is 2 log 4 plus log 6 then this will be plus this will be bar 3 so this we can write it as a negative 3 log 10 so we substitute so 2 into brackets log 4 0 0.60 Two one plus log six zero point seven seven eight two. Then we can write this one as remember log of ten is one. This one is one. And uh, negative three. You can also write negative three as bar three. This time is not negative three, but bar three. This is another way you can do this. So this question can have two solutions so we have already multiplied this so you don't need to multiply again so we got this one as 1.2042 then we add 0 0.7782 then plus bar 3 so we had already added this and we obtained the solution as one point 9824 so this is how we add this is characteristic we are going to add it here this will give 4 2 8 9 then this will give uh, 1 plus bar 3 will give bar 2 so this is another solution so in that question we can obtain two solutions the first solution so this is method one see this is method one and this is method two so the first method we the difference comes here uh, here that is where we get the difference between the first method and the second method so we get this solution and you also get these